what's up guys welcome back we're going to be solving another question in today's video where we have 3 to the k plus 3 to the k plus 3 to the k plus 3 to the k is equal to 180 and we need to find the value of the k in this question so on the left side we have the addition of 3 to the k meaning we can write it down as 3 to the power of k plus k plus k plus k which will be equal to 3 to the 4k is equal to 180 and okay i'm sure all of you guys already found the mistake in here this is actually a very common mistake that i've seen a lot of students making and this is not the correct way to go with this question and the way we have to go we know from the laws of the exponent when we have a to the power of m times a to the n this will be equal to a to the m plus n and we have a multiplication sign in here we have addition which means if we factor 3 to the k um, uh, we have four of these for each of them we get one plus one plus one plus one plus one or as we can see we have four three to the k equal to 180 we have three to the k times four is equal to 180 and in here we're going to divide each side of the equation by four so three to the k on the left side and on the right side we'll get 180 divided by four which will be 45 so we have the unknown value in the exponent the common way for these kind of situation is going with the log of each side we know when we have the log of a to the power of b the b always likes to go in the back so we'll have b times log of a so we'll do the log on each side we'll have the log of 3 to the k is equal to log of 45 here k is going to go in the back so we have k times log of 3 is equal to log of 45 so we have k times log of 3 is equal to log of 45 we can do for 45 9 times 5 and from the laws of the logarithm we know when we have log of a b this can be written as log of a plus log of b so we have k log of 3 is equal to log of 9 plus log of 5 so here for the 9 we can do 3 squared so again that squared or the 2 can go in the back uh, from the law that we talked about earlier about the a to the b as I mentioned, B likes to go in the, into the back. So 2 in here is our B. So K times log of 3 is equal to 2 log of 3 plus log of 5. And here we can divide each side by log of 3. Uh, since we have log of 3 in here and here. So K is equal to 2 plus log of 5 over log of 3. And so another laws of the logarithm when we have log of a over log of b this will be equal to log base b of a so k will be 2 plus log base 3 of 5 and this would be the final answer for this question again a common mistake at the beginning can mess up the answer very easy like what i was talking about in here uh, the question is not that complicated as long as we get comfortable with the laws of the exponent and logarithm that we covered in the channel over and over just to get comfortable with it's actually a pretty easy question so like this question actually was designed to trick student with the uh, second line that i talked about because that's going to lead you to different answer so yeah i hope you guys find this one helpful let me know if you have any other solutions any better way to solve these feel free to drop your questions in the comment section i'd be happy to answer those and you guys take care i'll see you in the next video have a good one